Hey, how's everybody doing? Uh, I wanted to come on here because I had some great, great training over the weekend in our firm and I wrote a whole bunch of things down. So my goal is to do a live video about all the points that I learned this weekend. So this is one of them about personal growth and what it is that you're doing specifically to grow yourself. And I'm not saying you need to like go to the gym, get jacked. I mean, that could be it, right? That's one of the things that you want to work on to get healthier. That's a form of personal growth. But I'm talking about, you know, really reading and, you know, getting better at something. Uh, I wanted to share with you my, a very shortened version of my journey into personal growth. And actually started when I was employed by the bank. And one of the biggest things that I saw at the bank was my ability to uh, mentor and lead people. And for those of you guys who've ever worked with me at the bank, you'll remember that I used to have not these typical sales meetings, but these meetings where we would talk about different things that necessarily didn't focus on just sales, but how we can get better at helping clients. And if you remember, I actually even bought like a projector that I can show a slideshow. And I don't think any other manager was doing that. But I was showing slideshows. I put a lot of work and heart into these sales meetings. And I remember loving it so much. And that's when I started to realize that I was a different type of leader. And uh, not better, just different. And, and one of the biggest uh, reasons was I got introduced to this book uh, by somebody at the bank, believe it or not. And uh, he just mentioned it and I just decided I'm gonna read it. So it's actually called The Seven Habits of Highly Effective People by Stephen Covey. And I would encourage you to pick it up. Um, a lot of it has to do with, you know, just habits, habits of people who are effective. And one of the biggest things from this book was making sure that you even paid attention to what was going on. I don't know how many days that I just kind of was on autopilot, 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 and not realizing the autopilot wasn't necessarily growing me. And you know what? When I started this book and I really got in, you know, really interested in this book, it just started, you know, a tidal wave of wanting to learn more and get better. It started with my health. And then it went into inspiration and motivation. And if you guys been follow, if you have been following me on Facebook, you'll remember I started doing live videos from my car on the way into the office, right? And it's because I was listening to podcasts on the way to work, and I haven't stopped. But you know what? That journey of growth and improvement and wanting to know more and not be, not be afraid to know that I have to learn more each and every day because no one here is perfect and I'm not perfect. I have to learn more to get better, right? I want to live my best life one day. And the only way to do that is to really learn more, um, feel motivated, hopefully motivate others. And so it started this whole journey of wanting more. And that got me to quit my J-O-B. And then that got me to open up my own business. And now I'm helping hundreds of people. And I can say hundreds. Because I'm now at the 200 mark. I can count the number of people I've helped or at least put plans together. Helping 10,000 families out of debt, right? That was a vision of mine when I decided to do this business. And so, um, wow, amazing how things can change. And you know what? My life is improved. My whole family's life is going to be improved because I decided to make a choice. So I hope that gave you inspiration. I hope you pick up this book. I hope you pick up any book. This is the last book I actually decided to pick up. I can't wait to read that. I just have to finish my other book. Um, but anyways, I hope it, I've inspired you too, to take a look at what you're doing on a daily basis to, to you know, even if it was 1% every day to get better at something. And I encourage you to reach out to me. Let me know what that is. What that is. I'd be interested to find out. Anyways, I got you all. I hope you have a fantastic day.